Okay. Um. So yeah guys, it's always good to come here to Caprimata. Awesome place, a lot of food, a lot of different people. Um, walking about is a Sunday. So this place usually packed on a Sunday. Yo guys, it's Herbs Magic here, Justin, um, with my boy Coz, we're in Cabramatta. We've got a saying here, it don't matter when you're in Cabramatta. <laughs> That's what's up, yeah. So yeah, today we're just gonna hang out. My man here used to, I think he grew up here when he was younger, right? Yeah, so I, I spent from about 13 years to 24, I grew up here, went to high school here, um, and I just kicked back. This is my hood, this is my area. We're gonna look at some sites of Caprimatta. My man's gonna talk a little bit about the background of this place and how it came about. And uh, you know, and also talk about his background. Uh, he's Vietnamese, right? No, I'm Cambodian, so. Okay, my bad. <laughs> no, no, my no, bad. it's all good, bro. My bad. I grew up with a lot of Vietnamese, but Cabra is home to a lot of Vietnamese, Southeast Asian. So Vietnamese, Cambodian, Laos. Um, it's a big community, just like Bankstown and other pockets of Sydney. Uh, but look, man, it's all good. <laughs> so basically, welcome to Southeast Asia. Yeah. My man's Khmer. I am Khmer. Hey, you got that. You got that. That's it. Oh, oh man. <laughs> I mean, I didn't just eat my lunch at school, man. <laughs> So, Cabra back in the day, like during the 90s, there was a lot of Southeast Asian like, uh, immigrants and refugees coming after the Vietnam War, the Khmer Rouge. And um, during the, the late 80s to 90s, Cabra was, you know, it was a shithole. It was basically a place full of gangs, drugs. It was actually known as the, car the heroin capital of Australia. <laughs> I love mangoes, bro. Mangoes are my jam. Quite busy, eh? Bro, it's like this every weekend, man. Ooh. Like this every weekend? Every weekend, man. It's like COVID never happens, you know? <laughs> now, is this how you remember when, when you were young? Absolutely, man. I feel like it's not changed one bit. If anything, this whole complex is new in the last five, six years. Um, this whole car park never used to be here. They're actually expanding the car park there. I don't know if you can see that down there. Okay. But um, they're building a second complex. Should have done this 15, 20 years ago, but I mean, they're doing it now. It's just gonna create more clutter, more, more busyness, I guess. So it's good, it's good. Across the road. Oh. So you should run around here with just a little kid, eh? Oh. Good memories? <laughs> good memories, bro. Like, the thing is, Back in the day when I was a kid, me and my, like my family would take us around, mum and dad, every second person would bump into, they'd say, hi, how are you? Like they knew everyone. And I'm just like, oh my God, just take me home. But this now is, is home. <laughs> nah, it's awesome. Yeah. Awesome to see. I mean, this is culture right here. This is it. Culture right here, guys. Precious fruits, man. This is a taste of Southeast Asia. Yeah, it's a taste <clears throat> of Southeast Asia. Woo. Yeah, we made it out. So, I see a fish market here. Here's a joke. Here's a joke for you. Hit me. What is a Trump's favorite movie? What? Prawn movies. <laughs> <laughs> okay, back to the land. Back to the land. <laughs> Sorry. That's so bad, it's good. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why you say that. Right here. Right here with my brother here. <laughs> giving you a good um, camera up here. There you go. Yo, Trump. yo, yo. So, so far, so good. Mm. As we go into here, I think one of the best pork roll uh, pork roll shops is inside here. I could be wrong, my memory could be a bit off. It's either this one or one of these ones. But the best gem pork rolls are actually hidden in the alleyways. Well, this is how they roll here in Cabra. <laughs> so we're gonna go find the, the, the dopest uh, pork roll. Let's go! <laughs> So the sign up there says Viet Hoa, Viet Hoa. 
So, not Viet Hors. <laughs> no, no, sorry, my bad. It's Viet Hors. What do, you, what do you think of us? What do you think of our women? <laughs> That's yeah. terrible. So, That's no disrespect to, to my people out there. But if you know how to pronounce yeah, that word, yeah. um, leave us a comment. <laughs> the thing about living in the area you have like three options it's either maccas snack packs or pork rolls like these are like the holy trinity <clears throat> yeah you heard it here first so drop a comment down to tell us about the, the pork rolls that you get from the area that you're at so how they compare to this one so and rate it from one to ten what do you rate one to ten on this what? you know what i give it a seven i give it a seven seven is good you know seven is good i so, um, I, because I, I don't live in Cabra anymore, I moved to the, the inner west and a couple of months ago, three months ago, I tried Marigold Pork Roll. Oof. That place, I place say solid nine. Yeah, that's gangster. <laughs> solid nine. Oh man. I don't mean to be hating on my own peoples, but like it is what it is. I, I bring the facts, I bring the truth. So. Well, I hope these guys heard you and <laughs> up their game. <laughs> They're either gonna like the only way they can get 10 if they double up the fillings inside these pork rolls. <laughs> <laughs> if they double it up, we'll give them 10. <laughs> Hello, um, can I get two pork rolls with chili? Yes, please. <clears throat> this lovely lady's working hard on the grind. So this is one of the spots. This spot here in, in Cabramatta is one of the best uh, pork spots. I've actually had a, a few here over the, over the years. Yeah. And highly recommend it. What do you know about the cash only? If you know, you know. <laughs> that don't need no explanation. There's a cash society here in Cabra, man. Yeah, exactly. cash, cash everything. Cozzy, thank you for having me. We're going to enjoy these delicious pork rolls. Make sure to subscribe, like, support my boy. Um, and check out the magic stuff. You won't be uh, disappointed. That's good. Just like magic. It's a mixed fruit shake. So what we put in here, we've got light cheese. we got... Oranges, strawberry, passion fruit, and jackfruit. Jackfruit is a key ingredient to getting jacked. Cheers. <laughs> you guys are missing out. <laughs> the business. It's definitely the business. You guys are missing out. Cheers. <laughs> okay. Uh oh. Pick a card. Let's go. Alright. I'm gonna shuffle it right in. Alright. Cause this is your card? What about this one? The two fours. Okay, wait. Let me let me check. Mm, no? No. Alright. I'm gonna take one four, I'm gonna put it up there. <laughs> one four. I'm gonna take the second four, I'm gonna put it there. I'm just gonna catch one card. That's your card. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Guys. This guy, you need to hire this guy. <laughs> you are going to Vegas. <laughs> That's a yes for me. <laughs> there you have it, guys. Thank you for tuning in. And big ups to my man, Herbs. Cheers, Cozzy. I had a good time. Definitely going to see more of us linking up together in the future. Make sure to check out his stuff. Check my stuff out as well. Peace out. Have a yeah. good day. Leave your link. Say, tell, tell, tell the people. Find me on Instagram at Herbs Magic. Um, yeah, so E R B Z M A G I C. Peace.